It's your boy EB. You're watching EB Family ENT. And if you like what you see, hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. So you could become part of EB Fuck Fuck Family. Is this a mixtape or an album? I would say it's an album. And All right, cool. Let's get it. Let's go. Get on the bed. Yo, this beat was banging too. But you guys know me. I like the the flow. She want me to be a baby father. Cause her baby father got a baby wallet. Bitch, get some money, you can maybe holler. Uh, but just to talk, you gotta pay me dollars. And that's comfy, comfy, paying rent monthly. But I ain't never there, I'm busy traveling around the country. Niggas couldn't punk me, niggas wanna jump me. But I keep that metal on me like I'm Forrest Comfy. Bitch, I keep it funky. said I keep that metal on me like I'm Forrest Gump. Gum feet or gum feet? I think it's like that forest gum feet because wouldn't he have the metal on his feet? Well, actually, why would he have metal on his feet? Yeah, because he got the cleats on. He, did he wear cleats when he was the fucking best football player out there? That was Forrest Gump, right? I'm try I swear, because there's another movie. I know Forrest Gump, y'all, but there's another movie that Adam Sandler played in, The Water Boy. That I might be confusing as well. But I know Forrest Gump. So I think he said feet. But I don't even care about that. The beat reminds me of a Lil Wayne. Uh, like an old school Lil Wayne beat. And that's what I was digging. Like rocking with. When I heard the song. And then you guys. I have subs in my car too. And I love bass. And I love flows. And so for me. I heard that beat drop. That's all I need to hear. So now we're going to go and try to actually catch the bar. Cause her baby father got a baby wallet. Bitch, what? Her baby father got a baby wallet. Oh, I didn't catch that. That's funny. Cause her baby father got, got a baby, baby wallet. wallet. Bitch. Bitch. Get some money, you can maybe holler. Uh, but just to talk, you gotta pay me dollars. And that's comfy, comfy. Paying rent monthly, but I ain't never there. I'm busy traveling around the country. Bags. Niggas couldn't punk me. Niggas wanna jump me, but I keep that metal on me like I'm Forrest Gump. Gone feet. Bitch, I keep it funky. Used to be a flunky. Now I'm getting brain. Ain't a question that can stomp me. All about my chase. All about my bread. So I be in the middle like a motherfucking lunch me. Bang. That part, I, but I, when I heard that, I was like, okay. That that was the lamest, but no offense, squad. But I'm just saying, when I heard that, bro, I was rocking with this song, and then I heard I, I be in between like some lunch meat. I was like, bro, there's no way he said lunch meat. And then he starts snapping right after this. Right after this point, this is why it uh, became one of my favorite songs. Right after he said lunch meat, because then I started connecting with all these bars, you guys. But I didn't. I did. I've heard the whole song, but I only heard it once. It was literally on the way home to here. So clearly I wasn't listening to the words. So it's still a genuine reaction. But sometimes this is how you find great songs to react. So the entire song is lame bar. Back. Now I'm getting brain in the question that can stop. So, all about my chase, all about my bread. So I be in the middle like a like motherfucking lion tree. Pain town faded, my goose down, pale out. My the green flow. brown purple in my white gray real out. All you do is work. Leave your girl alone. I'm a dirty ass chilling in your pad like real out. You <laughs> your dirty ass chilling in your pad. Or your dirty ass is chilling in my pad. No, fuck. How did he say it? I get the whole Brillo and the pad and the pad, the house. Uh, someone's chilling somewhere. But the dirty is what's fucking me up because if you're going to have a girl come over, so if you're talking shit and you were talking about a girl being there, you wouldn't say she was dirty. So I'm trying to figure out what I missed there. Faded, my goose down, my green, brown, purple, and my white, gray, red, all you do is work. Leave your girl alone. I'm a dirty ass chilling in your pad like Brillo. Yeah, now you leave your girl alone. Now, oh, you said now my dirty ass is chilling in your pad like Brillo. Okay, 
Okay, okay. I knew, I knew I had. Like Brillo. I get that a lot. I get that a lot. This, this shit was dope. That a lot. You making me mad, motherfucker. And this is probably why I don't want to ruin the reaction, y'all. But again, this is the first song we're reacting to today. And I have a bad habit of ruining the reaction, like the actual reaction, because I record these and then I put them out. Um, but I have to do it right now, because part of the reason I loved this song on top of the beat and on top of the chorus was the fact that when I heard that, Elise, the first people that came to my mind today was you, Kathy, and Amy. I swear this happened, Elise. You, Kathy, and Amy. I heard this chorus and I was like, oh, shit. And that's why I wanted to stream, why I wanted to react to this song specifically because you motherfuckers came to my damn mind when I heard this chorus. You making me mad, motherfucker. I get that a lot. You bad motherfucker. I get that a lot. 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 Fire. I get that a lot. I get that a lot. With my niggas smoking loud in the library. Not just any loud nigga, this Mariah Carey. When I smoke, swear that bitch is hitting high notes. And that's wavy, wavy. Fuck you, pay me. Anybody doubting me, they must be crazy. Dirty got them bugging shit, they must be stables. You be getting head from a buck teeth lady. I'm sorry. Okay. I can, you know what? I, I, I see what you're saying, Flawed. I see what you're saying. I see what you're saying. Because. Again, I only heard this one time, you guys, so you have to understand. And then with the subs, and then when I heard that chorus, I'm like, yo, this shit, like, I, I thought there was a lot more bars in here than there are. Like, he's barring the whole song, but the song, if the beat wasn't the way the beat was, like, this isn't a typical flawed flow at all. And I wouldn't even say it's like a typical flaw, like with the bars either. Usually he's throwing some doubles in there. I mean, he's not doing it the whole song most of the time, but he will throw a lot of, he's, it's either like inspirational. He's got so many inspirational bars, but on this one, this is just like talking shit, which is cool. And I don't know how long, how long ago the song came out. When was it? Yeah. Three, well, it was on YouTube three years ago. So when I first heard it, that beat was knocking. But now that I'm actually like sitting down listening and reacting to it, yeah, I can see why you don't really like this song too much. I was overhyping it, I think. You make me mad, I get that it's over 10 I years old, okay. I get, I get that a lot. But I'm not overhyping the chorus. That chorus is fire. That chorus hits, yo. And that beat hits. I get that a lot. In my high bitch, I'm high very. With my niggas smoking loud in the, in the library. library. Not just any loud nigga, this Mariah Carey. Nah, Carey. <laughs> I smoke, swear that bitch is hitting high, high though. And that's wavy, wavy. Fuck you, pay me. Hey, me. Anybody doubting me, they must be crazy. Dirty got them bugging shit, they must be stables. You be getting head from a got buck teeth lady. I'm something like a star though. You be getting head from a buck teeth lady, but did you say like skate? You said scabies? I think, I think that's what it was, scabies, because he said something about bug and then scabies, and scabies is technically a bug. Watch out for ticks, you guys. I had to sleep with, I had to sleep in the middle of Missouri. I didn't know what a tick was, and effing ticks. I didn't even know tick, humans could get ticks. I didn't even know that was a thing, and then I'm in the middle of basic training, and they're like, oh, yeah, we got to, there's just ticks around here. And they can give you Lyme disease. And no worries, but we're going to sleep outside in the wet around ticks for three nights in a row. Yo, I was picking ticks off of my skin. Be careful out there, man. He's a broad carry. It's high notes. And that's wavy, wavy. 
fuck you pay me. me. Anybody doubting me, they must be crazy. Crazy. Back. Bugging, shit, they must be crazy. You be getting head from a buck teeth late. Maybe. I'm something like a startup. Pockets be on Harpo. Flow first class while you sneaking in the cargo. You be going hard now. First you class cargo. Bar, I'm imposing an embargo. As far as niggas bars go. Wanna hear me rap, nigga? Tell me where the cash at. I'm about my money. Fuck the be in my ass cap. Niggas say I'm back. Fuck your BMI ass cap? What the hell is BMI? Is that like a diss to someone? Is that like a, a personal diss? What the hell is BMI? I don't know what BMI is. From a buck teeth lady. I'm something like a star though. Pockets be on Harpo. Flow first class while you sneaking in the cargo. You be going hard now. You ain't up the par. I'm imposing an embargo. As far as Body the math index. Go. Wanna hear me rap, nigga? Tell me where the cash at. I'm about my money. Fuck it, be your mind. Ass cap. Right. Nigga say I'm backpack. Nigga saying black whack. Drake call for you. Nigga said he want a swag back. You a Drake bad call bad for you. You want a swag back back. I get that a lot. I get that a lot. I get that a lot. You a bad motherfucker. I get that a lot. Can you be my bad motherfucker? I get that a lot. You making me mad, motherfucker. I get that a lot. And let's take a head, motherfucker. I get that a lot. Oh yeah, see, this is why I had to switch my mic, you guys, because you guys know how I get with the singing on here. Because I like to sing over the tracks. I, I see we have a lot of people here today, um, which is dope because I never go live early, but I like to sing over the tracks, especially if I really enjoy the chorus. And uh, yeah, now I switched my mic to where I got a mute where I could just turn it off right here. And so now I can sing without messing up the reaction. But yeah, I like that one. That one was cool. I will say with the verses themselves, I definitely like was like overhyping it. and. I mean, Flaw's in here right now, and he's even said, he, he said it from the beginning, this is his least favorite song. Uh, and so that made me actually more curious to try to figure out why, because in the car, the shit was banging. But the, you guys had, I don't, I, I don't know, the, the beat on this one, whatever low, I don't know what that's called, because I don't do music production. If Meta was actually here right now, which he should be in a few minutes, he would be able to probably tell me what, bass note that is that he used but whatever bass note that is on this beat specifically is like the perfect fucking note for my subs to the way that i have the ohms on my sub because i got it down to one ohm and that shit was fucking knocking and when you get that sometimes it overhypes song and it overhypes the whole feel because now you're not really listening for the lyrics but the chorus, the beat, fire. The uh, the verses though. Just check out more of his newer stuff. Uh, actually, not even his newer stuff. Because if you check out the beginning, Vlad was going crazy on the beginning. I love that song too. It's like an intro to his album. I think that it's called the beginning. I think that is the album name. But I could be wrong. But and that was around the same time as something like this. I think maybe just a few years in advance. Uh, so, you, so you don't have to go do his new, new stuff. But, but he's definitely grown throughout the years compared to a verse like this. And thank you, Flawed, for being here. We're going to jump right on into the next one, too.